Hello, I'm Daniel Kindred from ADAS in the UK, and I'd like to talk to you about a new platform that we're creating to really support on-farm experimentation. Crucially support the generation of knowledge on-farm and the sharing of knowledge across the whole community. We've been lucky that we've got a couple of um, Innovate UK projects who have support us in developing what we're calling Farm PEP, the performance enhancement platform. So the approach we're taking in Farm PEP is based on the approach we've developed in the Yen, our yield enhancement network that we formed in 2012. And whilst the Yen is focused on yield, we think that this approach can be used for any issue or opportunity or, or problem that, where we bring together people. We're bringing together farmers, researchers, industry, um, advisors to tackle an issue. When we think about this through four, four pillars to, 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 to bring together, that we're trying to bring together and support with Farm PEP. So the first is knowledge. So actually summarising the state of knowledge of what's known in a way that can be understood both by farmers and by researchers. That drives the metrics, the data that we can collect. Um, and so then provides a basis for farmers to actually then share data and then uh, and an incentive to share that data because they can see by benchmarking how they compare to others. And having those concepts and the, and the, and the data together allows us to then, as a group, form ideas around what, what is it that we could do differently on farm? What is it that we can then test um, in trials, in on-farm experimentation, and do that in a robust way, do it together in a coordinated way, where we can get to robust conclusions that we can then, we can then inform back into the knowledge base. I'll go through what we're doing in Farm PEP to support each of those four pillars. Starting with the first, so around knowledge, we're creating a, a platform at farmpep.net to connect people and, and, and projects and organisations with topics. And so we're providing a space where we can share information and, and share and, and distill knowledge around any topic. We're looking to create a, a, a viable business model to support this, so that we'll be running from the spring. And we're really looking to just for your support and um, your thoughts and how we can make that work. So if you, you can get involved at farmpep.net in that conversation and there's a survey that you can help us with as well. Secondly, thinking about the metrics and the data, we've now created a, a, an online database where we've got all of the yen data together and we've created what we're calling dynamic benchmarking, where farmers, users can log on and see their past data um, for a, a range of metrics and how they compare to the rest of the population. But rather than just seeing how they compare to the whole population, they can choose who they compare themselves to. So by soil type or, um, or variety or region. And we're looking to develop that in, in, in over the next two years in the, in the, in the new farm pet project. Thirdly, we're working with our partners, Innovative Farmers and AICC, to develop guidance around how we can support groups of farmers and advisors working together to develop ideas that we can then, then, then test. And fourthly, we're developing the software to support on-farm experimentation using our agronomics approach. Where we're wanting to be able to make the tools available to farmers and advisors to be able to run on-farm trials themselves. So I'm really excited to be developing Farm Pep over the next couple of years and really um, looking forward to engaging with many of you in doing so. So please do get in touch if, um, if you're interested in getting involved in any of this. Thank you.